No more chit chat talk. Get your hand off your cock. Get your fist out of your pussy. <laughs> Das heutige Video beginnt mit einer Hydrationstabelle. Hast du genug Wasser getrunken? Versuche mindestens zehnmal am Tag durchsichtigen Urin zu haben. Ernähre dich hauptsächlich von Obst und Gemüse. Trinke ein Liter Wasser vor jeder Mahlzeit. Vielen Dank. You fucking can't, you fucking can't avoid criticism. How to avoid criticisms? <lacht> you just can't. How to avoid criticisms? Actually, you can avoid criticisms. Do nothing, say nothing. Stand for nothing, be nothing, and you probably won't get criticized. Otherwise, learn to fucking deal with it. If you're saying what needs to be said, and it's bet for the betterment of the planet, and you're being criticized for that, or if you're doing what needs to be done for the betterment of the planet, and you're getting criticized for it, fuck it, who gives a fuck? Do it anyway. I uh, sent a video today by someone who just attended our festival. Jay offended, our, offended, attended, I said he offended our festival. He attended our festival, and we went to a, we were hiking down the mountain one day and a bunch of guys said, hey, do you know where the organic market is? I'm like, well, I'm not sure, but I think it's down here. So I took a bunch of people down the, the mountain, jumped on our bikes, went to the market, and I had no money with me. I, always, I had 50 baht with me, $2 I spent on the mountain. I'm fucking getting pretty hungry, getting, almost getting thirsty, but I thought I'll show the guys where the market is. It's going this way. And uh, we're looking around the organic market and I'm thinking, man, I need to get home. So I was sort of pretty just out of it, wanted to get out of there. I didn't buy anything. I had no money. I had no money in my pocket. And Jay put up a video today saying, oh, you know, like, during all I was pretty disappointed in him because he makes so much money on that, but he didn't even support local organic farmers. I was pretty, you know, I was pretty disillusioned by that. <laughs> it's like, well, I didn't have any fucking money to spend at the fucking market. Instead of making an assumption and criticizing, get more information before you make an assumption. That's what, that's all I tell people. And I, I've got no, nothing to, doesn't take no offense to it, but it just, it's more of a, It's a lesson in life that people are too easy to judge, too quick to judge, too quick to criticize when they don't have all the facts. If you have a problem with someone, ask them, say, hey, are you into organics and vegan? How come you're not buying anything here? Is it not good enough or whatever? Versus just making an assumption ahead, making up a lie, and then sharing that on social media. That's not really what the community is about. There's a fucking ice cream truck behind me. This is a dead end. This is a dead end. Sometimes you get dead ends in life, You gotta turn around and go back out the other way. So how to avoid criticisms? You just can't. So we'll do what else needs to be done. And I see a lot of girls on the internet, you know, with so much potential, and guys as well. These people with so much potential, and they might do a video or think about doing a video, but then they're like, oh my God, people are gonna criticize me. <laughs> If you want total adoration, then you're gonna fucking have a fucking bitter, fucked up life. If you think everyone's gonna adore you all the time for everything you do. That's fucking bullshit. You're gonna share your heart and opinion to the world and everyone's gonna love you. That's fucking delusional. That's the shit that gives people psychotic, psychotic psychosis. That's what creates mental health issues. When you think everything you do, people are gonna love. And then you can't handle criticism, man. That's not fucking healthy. So do what needs to be done. Say what needs to be fucking said for the betterment of the planet. Not just meaningless bullshit, but for real good shit, good causes. Especially on social media today. There's so much flakiness bullshit out there where people are just scared about sharing their opinion when it needs to be fucking said but they just don't do it because they're just too scared of it. <laughs> people are scared of getting criticized man so don't be scared of getting criticized. There's a little beagle barking at me. Bottom line man, if you don't, if you don't want to be criticized, put your fucking camera down, turn off social media, cease your existence, blow your fucking brains out. But even if you blow your fucking brains out, people when you're dead, people are still going to criticize you and say, what a fucking dumb fuck for killing themselves. So criticism, criticizing, criticizing, get used to it. I do it, you do it, everyone fucking does it. Everyone judges. People say don't judge, they're fucking full of shit. So many people say, I'm not judgmental. Harley, you're a fucking cunt. You just judge me then. Is it, hypocriti is it hypocritical to call someone judgmental? Oh, you judge people, you criticize people. So do you, you just do it to me now. And that's fucking fine. We're all fucking human. We all criticize. We're all going to get criticized. We all judge. We're all going to get judged. So just make sure your daily actions are in line with your ethics. Align your life with your life purpose. Align your daily activities with your life purpose. Do what needs to be done for the greater good of the planet and the animals. People say, you guys aren't activists or whatever. Where the fuck are your YouTube videos? You got two videos with fucking half a view or whatever. What the fuck are you doing? 
Now, don't say that with anger, I say that with frustration and passion. Get off your fucking ass, take some fucking action, back up your fucking talk, mate. Walk your fucking talk. If you're gonna criticize, make sure you're standing up, pointing down, and say, come on, fucking up here, doing all this freely. This is how it's fucking done. Show us how it's fucking done. No more chit chat talk. Get your hand off your cock, get your fist out of your pussy, take some fucking action, and link us to that action. And we'll support you 100,000 fucking percent. Thanks for watching. A little doggy jaw. A little dog chin. <laughs> You're not gonna criticize me, are you, little doggy, anymore? Be a good little dog. <laughs>